Hello friends, those who are already on our live streaming for the Divine Mercy Novena. Good afternoon to you all. We ask that you share this live streaming on your uh, Facebook page so that others could be encouraged uh, to pray with us. If you could do that for us. Uh, just be, uh, before we start our novena in a couple of minutes, that will be great. Thank you. Share your, share this live streaming on your Facebook page. God bless. Peace be with you, friends. Once again, we are grateful that you have joined us for our eighth day Divine Mercy Novena. Before we begin, we want to ask you to share uh, this live stream, uh, our Novena on your Facebook page so others can be encouraged uh, to pray with us, at least to know that we've been praying for them. So thank you for uh, sharing this live stream. Let's begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Opening prayer. You expired, Jesus, and the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world, a fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us O blood and water which, which gush forth from the heart of Jesus as the fount of mercy for us I trust in you O blood and water which gush forth from the heart of Jesus 
as a fountain of mercy for us. I trust in you. O blood and water, which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fountain of mercy for us, I trust in you. Our Father, our Father, who art in heaven, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done. Thy will be done. On earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not, and lead us not into temptation, into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The Apostles' Creed together. I believe, believe in God, God the, the Father, Father Almighty, Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and, and in Jesus Christ's Christ, only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, Spirit born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, 
soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord, Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and on the whole world. We'll sing the last decade. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and the blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins, and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy, holy God, God, holy, holy mighty, mighty one, one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, holy mighty one, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. 
Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Closing prayer. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself. Amen. Amen. Let us say together the act of consecration to the divine mercy. Most merciful Jesus, Thy goodness is infinite, and thy treasure of grace inexhaustible. I have infinite trust in thy mercy, which is above all thy works. I surrender myself entirely to thee, and without reserve, that I may thus live and strive for Christian perfection. I desire to spread thy mercy through the performance of both spiritual and corporal works of mercy, particularly in converting sinners, in consoling and aiding the needy, the afflicted, and the sick. Guard me then as thy possession and thy glory, for while I have everything to fear from my human weakness, at the same time, I have everything to hope for from thy mercy. May all men come to know the fathomless depths of thy mercy, to confide in it, and to glorify it forever. Amen. We'll say the uh, prayer for the eighth day of Novena. Jesus our Lord speaks. Today bring to me the souls who are detained in purgatory and immerse them in the abyss of my mercy. Let the torrents of my blood cool down their scorching flames. All these souls are greatly loved by me. They're making retribution to my justice. It is in your power to bring them relief. Draw all the indulgences from the treasury of my church and offer them on their behalf. Oh, if you only knew the torments they suffer, you will continually offer for them the alms of the Spirit and pay off their debt to my justice. Most merciful Jesus, you yourself have said that you desire mercy. So I bring into the abode of your most compassionate heart the souls in purgatory, souls who are very dear to you and yet who must make retribution to your justice. May the streams of blood and water which gushed forth from your heart Put out the flames of purgatory, that there, too, the power of your mercy may be celebrated. Eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon the souls suffering in purgatory, who are enfolded in the most compassionate heart of Jesus. I beg you, by the sorrowful passion of Jesus, your Son, and by all the bitterness with which his most sacred soul was flooded, manifest your mercy to the souls who are under your just scrutiny. Look upon them in no other way, but only through the wounds of Jesus, your dearly beloved Son. For we firmly believe that there is no limit to your goodness and compassion. Amen. Jesus, I trust in you. 
Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, alleluia, alleluia. Thanks be to God, alleluia, alleluia. Dear friends, thank you for participating today. And uh, those of you who have joined us for the first time, we're so grateful. Today is the feast day of the one of the beautiful saints that we have in the church. Her name is Kateri Tekawitha. She is uh, one of the few uh, American native saints. Um, so we today pray for all uh, indigenous uh, people uh, in North America. We uh, ask the intercession of St. Kateri to continue to uh, give them their, uh, uh, our Lord's grace to help them to love the Lord and faithfully follow him and to immerse them in, in God's mercy. So, as we celebrate this beautiful uh, feast day of uh, our saint, uh, just, just in case if you didn't know, her uh, the relics uh, are uh, reserved in, uh, in a church, St. Francis Xavier Church in, I believe, uh, near Montreal. And uh, if you, maybe one day when things get better, maybe it's one of the things you could do to go and visit uh, this beautiful shrine. So I want you to um, write down your favorite saint. Write down your favorite saint in the comment. And I want you to press, uh, give us a thumbs up or the heart or the smiling face. Not those angry faces, but the smiley faces, smiley ones. Okay. While you are doing that, I'm going to just give you a little uh, insert, uh, I guess, summary of uh, uh, Saint Catherine Teca with us life. Her name, given name, is Teca with us, but she was baptized as Catherine, um, and informally known as Lily of the Mohawks. She is. Uh, she was born in the uh, Mohawk village of uh, Osernahum on the south side of a Mohawk River in the present day New York State. She contracted smallpox in an uh, epidemic. Her family died and her face was scarred, but she converted to Catholicism at age of 19 when she was named Kateri and baptized in honor of St. Catherine of Siena. She refused to marry, and she left her village and moved for the remaining five years of her life to the Jesuit mission village um, of uh, Kanaweke, south of Montreal, on the St. Lawrence River in New France, now known as Canada, our own country. And uh, she took a vow of perpetual virginity, and upon her death at the age of 24, witnesses said, that the minutes later her scars vanished and her face appeared radiant and beautiful. She's known for her, the virtue of chastity and mortification of the flesh, as well as being shunned by some of her tribe for her religious conversion to Catholicism. She is the fourth Native American to be venerated in the Catholic Church and the first to be canonized. So friends, Saint Kateri Teka with us, pray for us. Friends, we're going to sing, we're gonna to sing together the song that you love the most. As a matter of fact, it's my one of favorite hymns. Lord Jesus, we must know you. Lord Jesus, we must know you. If you will make you known 
for how can we proclaim you but by your grace our Lord we long to know your fullness your life of reason power for you alone can answer the challenge of this hour. Our broken world is seeking what only you can give. Our words may go unheeded, but not the way we live. O Savior, live within us, your life so strong, so true, that others touched with wonder may seek and worship you. Lord Jesus, by your Spirit, renew your church, we pray. Till what we are makes valid the truth of what we say. So truly may we know you, so make your life our own. That we become so like you, our lives must make you know. Dear friends, thank you. We'll see you tomorrow at the same time, 3 p.m. Invite your friends and your uh, family members uh, to join us from the heart of our Heavenly Father. This is St. Barnabas. God bless you all.